What's up, big time gang? Welcome back to another video. This one here is from the Roebuck Watch Company, and this is the Ranger Black. They consider this to be like a sports dress. Hey, I can see myself. What up, people? <laughs> I see myself in the crystal there. Kind of scary. Let's get that to not look at my face. So they consider this a sports dress field watch, kind of all of the above. I look at this and I see a field watch, but it is a very clean three hand dial with no date. We'll get into the specifics right now, but let's start out with 316L stainless steel brushed and polished case. So you have brushed on the bezel, high polished on the bezel side, high polished on the case side, bead blasted. And that indention there that's kind of like carved out, which I like. I like that design on the case. Then we've got brushed lugs on the top side. Non-screw down crown. This one controls the inner rotating bezel. And it does not click really. And it is very easy to rotate. So if when putting this watch on, you bump it, it's going to adjust that inner rotating bezel. And then the crown itself is also not screwed down. They are signed. And they are um, push-pull. So, 42 millimeter case diameter. 11.9 millimeters thick. 49.7 lug to lug. 22 millimeter lug width and we have it on this canvas camo strap that kind of has the NATO style buckle and keepers cool looking watch very simple uh, tool watch for sure 100 meter water resistance or 330 feet we have an engraved solid case back. You got that round rock, Japanese movement, sapphire crystal, stainless steel. Sapphire crystal does have anti-reflective coating. One positive I can say is that this watch is out of Texas. So shout out to the Texas boy USA watch gotta love that it comes with a tapered Italian strap as well there's a strap the leather strap that it comes with genuine leather nothing too special and then we've got a travel case that comes with it this is a demo so I do not have the travel case that comes with but um you do get a travel case when purchasing the watch. We have two crowns, crown at the four o'clock and crown at the two o'clock. The two o'clock rotates the inner rotating bezel while the four o'clock sets the time and you can wind it from there. We have printed numerals with BGW9 Superluminova and then we have Superluminova C1 on the hands matte finish black dial with simple text we got the roebuck logo and the roebuck text at the 12 o'clock and then we have the ranger at the six o'clock japanese miyota 9039 no date movement 42 hour power reserve so this is equivalent to the miyota 9015 the only difference is there's no date function, no ghost function. It's just not there at all. And this watch weighs in at a total of 99 grams. So pretty lightweight. Good size at 42 millimeter. On my 8 inch wrist. Fits really well. 42 millimeter case diameter. 11.9 millimeters thick. I think it looks great. Definitely looks apart. I won't even put the leather on it. I'm not a fan of leather and there's no need. But this nylon camel strap 
looks the part definitely makes it look filled for sure and it's kind of distressed so i like that look this isn't a, a strap that i would choose if i was going to do a strap it'd definitely be like a silicone but i think this fits the watch very nicely as is so shout out to ross from rmg luxury this is where the watch came from rmg luxury has been hooking me up with demos to uh, share with you guys and I've been introduced to quite a few brands because of him. So definitely grateful for that. And uh, this is another company I've never experienced. Roebuck Watch Company. And uh, definitely a, a nice watch. Price point on this is $4.99. I believe um, I may be able to get you a discount. If you're interested, hit me up and I'll see what I can do. But uh, let's get into the loom. Let's see what the loom looks like. I told you we have Superluminova C1 and BGW9. And let's check it out. Looks great. All numerals are lit up. I see the second hand. Where is the hour hand? Is the hour hand under the minute hand? Wow, that crown is hard to pull out, especially when I can't see it. I have no fingernails and I cannot get a grip. Oh yeah, there it is. So it's not charged, so you see the difference because it was blocked by the minute hand, it is not charged. But, so that's another gripe I have for sure, is that the uh, crown is very hard to grip without fingernails, I bite my nails bad habit i know but trying to get that crown to pop out i can't just pull it it just slides right off so i have to get my fingernail underneath it and for me that's a pain because i don't have fingernails that stick out very far so that's definitely another gripe first gripe was the crown does not screw in so you bump this as you put it on so two little gripes there Overall, nice watch. Definitely check them out if you like it. Um, I'd say this is comparable to an Hamilton, but you get the Swiss made heritage and you get a lot of watch from Hamilton. So I think Roebuck has some work to do to up the ante on this watch to be able to compete with that price point of Hamilton. Um, I don't think I've ever paid over like 420, 440 for any of my Hamilton field watches. So if I'm paying that much for the field watch and that's what this technically is, I think we need to be a little lower on the price point. At 499 retail, I think they're a little high for what you're getting for sure. But cool watch nonetheless. Let me know what you guys think. Stay tuned for the photos and we'll see you in the next one. God bless. <laughs>